today we're going to have a little go at making these little pots made out of felt uh, fleece. So you should have a selection of stuff left in your pack. It doesn't really matter. They don't have to be the same colours. Um, you can just use whatever you've got. But roughly about that much is what you need for your pot. But you could mix it up. Um, and if you've got one of the blends left, it doesn't matter what colour, you can use that as well. The other things you're going to need is your bubble wrap. You're going to need this little thing here, which is the resist. And you're going to need your soap flakes. You should have plenty of those left as well. Uh, empty bottle for making up your solution. Um, and that's about it. Right. So we're going to take some of the, the fleece. Um, let's check that you can see that okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take sections of the fleece like that. And you're going to lay it from the middle outwards. And we're going to go all the way around in a circle. So I'm going to do it kind of quickly, um, just to let you see, overlapping it. Going. So you're overlapping your little circle thing by about an inch or three centimetres ish all the way around until you get back to the beginning again. Okay. And that's our first one, first circle. So we just pop that over to the side for a minute. Oops, where's my little thing gone? Here we come. And then you're going to do exactly the same again. So second piece of fleece and from the middle out, over overlap by about an inch, three centimetres. And then off we go all the way around again. Oops. So you can take your time doing this a little bit more than I'm doing. I'm just going kind of quick just so that I can let you see how to do it. So just each section at a time and you're going round in a circle until you've used up your fleece and you've got it all covered like that. So that's stage one. Okay, back again. So what I've just gone and done is made up my soapy solution. So I uh, should have some soap flakes left soap flakes and warm water. If you haven't got soap flakes left, remember you can just grate some soap and put it in. So it's hand warm water, not boiling, just, just warm. So next thing we're going to do is you're going to, you've, you should have your two circles and then your little thing like that will resist. So you're going to wet one of the circles in the middle. Now, it needs to be wet enough that it's right through. Okay, and then you're going to pop that on like that, squash it down. Okay, and then we're going to go round, all the way around the edge. I'm going to wet down that. Okay, and then carefully, what you're going to do is you're just going to fold it over. Now you can either use your bubble wrap to help you or you can just peel it and fold it. So all the way around, you're trying your best not to get too many folds in it, okay? Just all the way around like that. I should just turn it around to make it easier for myself. All the way. Again, you can take a little bit more time over this than I'm doing. Um, all the way like that. Then we're going to wet this chap. I'm going to take this one and we're going to flip it over onto there. Now there should be enough water on that for you to do this without having to wet it anymore. So we're going to go all the way around the edge, 
smoothing them in. Try not to get any folds if you can. So just working yourself right the way around the edge of your little zest like that. So it starts to look more like a circle. Uh, now, if you want to decorate it at all, you could take your um, blended colour or just a different colour. It doesn't really matter um, what you use, but you can just decorate it by laying down some bits, whichever way you like. I just turn that over and then just fold them in just like we did with the other ones All right. uh, so it ends up looking like that uh, now we're going to need our bubble wrap so bubbles up and you're going to fold it over like so pat it down gently a little bit of soapy water on the top now this is really important when you do this bit, you're going to be nice and light and a flat hand and you're going to work from the outside of the circle in towards the middle. So outside in, gently all the way around your pot. So once you get confident you could do it like that, so you're using your fingers and you're bringing them in and just moving it round all the time. So you're going to do this for five minutes on one side and then you're going to flip your pot over and you're going to do five minutes on the other side and then we'll have a look at our pots. So I've been rubbing one side for five minutes and then the other side for five minutes and then we'll uncover it, leave the bubble wrap there if we need it. Um, so now really we, it should be stable enough that we can start rubbing on the fleece. Um, you want to just check that when you pull it that it doesn't all come apart, see how I can, it still kind of stays together. So keep plenty of soap on your hands and plenty of soap on the um, circle and you're just going to rub it between your two hands like that. And the heat of your hands helps this process, so just turning it round and rubbing it like that. And then with your hand all the way round the edge, like so. Now. In terms of how long you do this for, I'm going to time myself and I'll tell you roughly how long it takes. But what will happen is the fleece will shrink and it will start to curl up like that. So it'll make this kind of funny shape as it shrinks and curls up. And when it gets to that point, we're ready to go on to the next stage. 